We're here live on the red carpet at TIFF 22 at Butcher's Crossing, the premiere. In just a little bit, we're going to be talking to Nicolas Cage. The movie is based on John Williams' novel, and it's a Western movie, so we're excited to talk to him. Hi, Nicholas. How are you? Well, thank you. So Butcher's Crossing, what kind of drew you to this role? Well, I grew up, uh, believe it or not, reading books like uh, Jack London's uh, The Sea Wolf, Call of the Wild, as well as Herman Melville's Moby Dick and uh, Conrad's Heart of Darkness. And these books, I always thought there was a character in each of them, whether it be Ahab or Wolf Larsen or Kurtz, that would be fascinating to play because there are examinations of what can go wrong in the human condition. And again, in this book, Butcher's Crossing by John Williams, that happens with Miller. Now, with the, in this case, this is a story dealing with a time and a place where this group of people got to a point where the American buffalo almost went to near extinction. And that, what is that bloodlust? What is that greed? What is that ambition? What is that misguided philosophy that can get people's hearts to go that far in the wrong direction. And it was connected because the you know, American buffalo was connected to the First Nations life source and the land. So you kill the buffalo, you kill the people. And that's tragic and that happened. And so I thought, well, let's, as, as ugly as that is, as horrific as that is, and it's gonna be my face playing that part, it needs to be reflected. Not that it's a message movie, but just that it's something that we need to remind ourselves so it doesn't happen again. But it is still happening. You know, it's happening with trees. It's happening with other life forms. It's happening with the planet, you know. Nick, my show is all about inspiration. So I have to ask you, I like to inspire my viewers. What's the best advice someone gave you in your life that inspired you? I think it was Martin Sheen. I, before Charlie or myself really started hitting it, I went over to, to visit and we were watching movies and Martin came into the room and he said, you know, if you want to have this life in cinema, the only thing that really matters is, did you like where you were and did you like the people you were working with? And, and I thought at the time he didn't say, I was like, well, no, that's not what it is. It's about the story. It's about, you know, the, the, the passion. But then I realized doing this as long as I have that he was right. And I do look for, do I like this person? Do I like where I am when I make a decision to make a movie?